Yeah, hi, it's Martin Burt here, and um, I'm so excited to bring you this um, video all about uh, a plugin called InstaBuilder. Now, some of you may have heard of it, um, and some of you uh, may not have done. But what InstaBuilder does basically, it allows you to build squeeze pages, sales pages. You can even put sort of fancy stuff within your blog posts and that sort of thing but it allows you to do it very very quickly and very easily yeah absolutely minutes so what i'm going to quickly do yeah you know, uh, while we're in here is to basically show you quickly how it actually works so once you've um, obviously got the plugin and you've installed it and activated it just like any other plugin in wordpress you'll probably get a uh, a link down on the bottom left hand corner here where it says insta builder and this is where you can go and uh, add your settings so you can add settings such as uh, facebook um, and twitter in there and uh, the api keys all that sort of thing it's fairly simple to do they walk you through it and there's loads and loads of training videos as well so um, nothing to worry about there um, and then what also happens is you get uh, these boxes here which you don't normally get within the normal WordPress um, WYSIWYG, so to speak. So you've got one box here which has all the styles, another one with a font family, which gives you far greater font that you can actually put into your posts now. Um, you've got obviously the font size, which goes up to 36 points. And then this one, which says InstaBuilder, which basically gives you loads and loads of different things. Now I'll quickly run through this, but basically as you can see from here when it's got MP4 video, YouTube, Vimeo, you can literally just click on those um, and go through it. You can have two or three or four columns. You can split the page. You can add buttons. You can add larger buttons. You can put featured boxes, pop-up images, pop-up content. You can even put today's date in there or a countdown clock or even an opt-in form. And this is... Uh, well, even fantastic you can put an opt-in form anywhere on the page if you want so if you've got someone reading a fantastic blog post and then you want to actually sort of make it into sort of like a squeeze page by having an opt-in form within the in your uh, post then you can do that it's absolutely amazing so let's quickly just give you uh, an idea of how you can actually uh, use this okay now we've got uh, the page here now, if you scroll down then, so that's all those bits covered at the top. If you scroll further down, you've got a, um, a box here which says Insta Builder Settings. OK, and what this basically means is um, you can then build a perfectly normal page. You can be typing stuff in here and this would then be published as a normal page on your WordPress blog. Or it could be a post as well. So a post or a page, you can do either. But just with a click of the uh, box here, you can actually turn it into a landing page, okay, or a squeeze page. So if we tick that box, you've then got the option here of having a squeeze page, a mini squeeze page, a single column page, which means that it's ideal for sort of sales pages, opt-in confirmation, thank you pages, download pages, etc. Or you can have a video page. So you can have a video sales page, a launch page, etc. Or you can have a product launch page as well. So loads of different variations there. So I'm I'm yeah, you know, after a few weeks I'm still looking at all these and playing around with it. Um the page design, again, loads of different designs here. Just click on it and you can go through all the different designs here. Um, again, so you can make everything totally unique. Page colour, well you've got that as well. You've got different colors here you can use so again the the options you have here are phenomenal a couple of other things here you've got a headline area so you would then use this to put your headline in your particular page obviously you can show the top navigation the footer navigation and you can actually put a copy right in the bottom as well so it makes your pages look you know really really professional and that's just the main page settings. As you can see here, guys, you've got as well, you can add in custom backgrounds. So literally you can just add in a custom background. You can add in your logo. So if you wanted to make it very brandable, you can. But this is the uh, exciting thing is the opt-in. Now again, uh, with the opt-in, 
all you literally have to do is copy and paste your autoresponder code. Now, if you've obviously gone and hooked up for your, uh, for your autoresponder, which you should get, by the way, uh, if you're going to be successful online, you do need an autoresponder and you do need to be building a list. It is absolutely vital for you to do that. So this is why this, this plugin is so fantastic. And you've got loads of different stuff here and, and you've got the uh, forms here and that sort of thing. I'm not going to go into this in too much detail um, because, uh, you know, we'll be here literally all night. But as you can see, you can add in videos, you can do stuff with comments so you can get people to share and that sort of thing. You can add in share buttons quite easily. You can pop an exit redirect. So if someone tries to actually click away from your page, you can actually put a thing that says, oh, hang on, wait, you know, stay on the page and I'll give you this free gift or something like that. So again, it gets your opt-ins even better. You can actually add a viral download, which basically means is that uh, you can force someone to share and then they will get the download. So if you were giving away a free product, you say, Here's the free product. All you've got to do is share it to Facebook or tweet it out and then your download link will be available and you can download it for free. OK, what we're going to do is very quickly make a squeeze page. As you can see, we've set on the squeeze page there. We've got the wallpaper, so we're going to leave that as is. And we're going to leave that as blue. So as you can see, we've got a headline here where we're obviously going to leave that as is just to show you for this uh, you know, um, scenario. What we've also got up here, we're just going to put in here. This is um, a test squeeze page. Now with this, let's just have a show. You can highlight that and bring it to the center. You can mess about with the font family. So you can do a different font in there if you wish. So let's have a look. Um, uh, let's do this one because it's totally different. We can get the font size different. So we can put it up to because we've got that. We can obviously do a style. So if we wanted to, um, we could highlight it in red. So there we go. So it's highlighted in red. So that's pretty cool. Um, underneath, we could do certain things. Look, let's uh, just show you here. We can put maybe a featured box. So if we put a featured box there, as you can see. So what we now need to do is quickly go and click on the opt in. I've got some autoresponder code here, which we can just literally just click in. These can be changed. So it says here, get your free stuff now. Uh, simply enter your information, information below to get instant access today. You could put optional images in here. Um, you can actually put what you want in there. So you've got your email, your first name and your email address. And these are all your pre-made buttons. So again, you can have loads of different pre-made buttons. This is how quick and easy it is, guys, to actually do this. So we'll get, get instant access now on an orange button. And you've got a privacy notice there. Then all we have to do, make sure our box is ticked here. And we'll go and publish. Remember, this is a page. There we go. The page is done. And then we click view. OK, so we just need a quick title in there. I forgot to put in. So if we put uh, test squeeze and we'll update that. OK, so we're updated. Let's see if we can view the page. And as you can see, guys, look, we've made a very, very simple opt in page very, 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 very quickly. So that's how quickly you can do it. If you wanted to change this. So for argument's sake, we wanted to make it into a mini sales page with a different background. OK, let's just click back to the edit page. We'll scroll down to the bottom here. We can click this and make it into a mini squeeze page. We can change uh, the background to reverse. We'll change the color as well. Let's go with let's go with red. OK, so that's all been changed. All we need to do is update. There we go. That's updated. So let's view the page. And there we go. A totally different opt-in page guys that is how quickly it is now you can obviously change the button you can change the the, the, the writing in here so your header can be different these can all be changed uh, just uh, you know very very quickly and easily 
Like I say, this is a phenomenal plugin. Um, now I know you can get, there are other uh, sort of software out there like this. Um, you've got uh, lead pages and you've obviously got optimized press is another one that you can build you know, fantastic squeeze pages and uh, sales pages, etc. But I just wanted to quickly show you this. What I would recommend, if you scroll down uh, underneath this video, there is a link where you can go, you can actually purchase this plugin. Now, uh, yes, it is a paid plugin, but it's fantastic value. Um, I think the single license uh, is uh, for a single site is $47. And uh, the multiple license, which means you can put it on as many sites as you like, is only $77. So if you're in a few niches, got a few different websites uh, that you're building, then you know, the, the multi-site is a no-brainer, really, at just $77. Now, I know, you know, obviously, I've said before, don't go and buy products that you don't need. Well, in my opinion, this is something that you are going to need. You are going to need squeeze pages. You are going to need to be able to uh, have sales pages. So this is the one tool that you're going to need and be able to use again and again and again. And not only that, it's a very small one-time fee. So there's no monthly recurring costs to you. So like I say again, it's $47 for the single license and $77 for the multi-license. Now, and what I'm also going to do for you is if you purchase under uh, this uh, video, on the link under the video, what I'll actually do, I'll throw you in some video courses all about the social media. So marketing on Facebook, Pinterest, Google+, um, Twitter. Uh, so that you've got all those um, five big social networks. So whichever social network you're on, basically send through and give you access to a video course all about using those particular social networks for your internet marketing. There's a little bonus for you just for scrolling down and buying on the link below this video. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, very short overview of this amazing product. Once you've gone and purchased, basically all I need you to do is then send me through um, an email uh, with your proof of your purchase and I will then give you access to all the five uh, social media video courses that you can then use for free um, as a bonus for buying through the link underneath this video. Okay, I'll see you again soon on the next video. Okay, bye for now.